But uncensored truth right here on Illuminati Radio with your host, Pastor Michael Smith, co-host, Sister Smith, Sister Smith, baby. If you're new to this channel, you just stumbled across this channel, you just stumbled across this channel, please hit that subscribe button, turn on your notification bells, especially hit that like button, that's a must that you guys got to hit that like button. Let's get this truth out there. Start up the magazine, hit that like button. Don't forget, people, Bible study class every night at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You want to know who you are? You want to know what's going on in the world? You got to tune in right now every night at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Bible study class. Right here. Right here. Hit that subscribe button so you can get the notifications. And don't forget, whatever streaming platform you get your podcast at, or you, where you listen to your music at, wherever you listen to your music or your podcast at, all you have to do is type Illuminati Radio in that platform and watch my logo come up and hit that follow button and check out the content. Check out the podcast. Okay, so we have a popular Chicago rapper. Remember, when you hear the word G-A-Y, Sister Smith, you make sure you say zesty. Replace that word with zesty. We got to do this for the YouTube algorithms. <laughs> Lord, Lord, Lord. Go ahead. Popular Chicago thug rapper accused of kissing transgender. Ooh, Lord, zesty. Zesty, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's put it like that. Uh, so a popular, you know what I'm saying, uh, Chicago rapper is accused of kissing a zesty man. Lord. While in prison. While in prison. What did I tell you? What did I tell you, Sister Smith? Let me tell you black women something. I said this on the last video. I'm saying this on this one. Let me tell you black women something. If your man just is obsessed with you giving him head. Every time you turn around, all he wants is head. He in the living room, he wants you to give him head. He in the kitchen, he wants you to give him head. You in the bathroom, you in the shower, where you in the car driving down the street, he wants you to give him head. If he's obsessed with that, understand that is the only thing a zesty man can do because a zesty man don't have what you women got you women got something precious in between your legs and the zesty men don't have it so the only way that they can please men is to give them head so you got to be aware when you hear about your man always wanting you to give him head just know that your man is kind of zesty oh he loves zesty people Understand that. Understand that. Don't, and that's how it is in the chain gang. If your man is in the chain gang or have been in the chain gang, spent some time in the chain gang, let me tell you something. Nine times out of ten, he done got himself some head from a zesty zest. Nine times out of ten, he done got himself some head from a zesty zest. <laughs> For real, I listen to. I've been in the chain gang, and I've seen so many things that happened in the chain gang. The toughest, roughest Negroes is the ones that be chasing them zesty boys around the cell block. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That's how they do. So be aware, black women. Be aware. Go ahead. Popular Chicago rapper King Little J. King yes. Little J. Okay. The, the J-A-Y? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Is making news after he was reportedly caught on camera kissing a zesty man, inmate, while in prison. In the video, which was reviewed by Media Takeout, a man resembling King Little J can be seen hanging out with a zesty inmate. That's what they do. I'm telling you, man. The toughest, roughest Negroes that's in the chain gang, you know what I'm saying? Or that get released back out to the street. I'm telling you what they do. Don't let them fool you. Don't let them sweet talk you. They got some zesty zest. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm telling you. I've seen it. I've seen it happen. You know what I'm saying? I've seen, you know what I'm saying? Too many tough, rough <laughs> black men 
in the chain gang. You know what I'm saying? And then after they playing with these zesty zest men, what do they do? They go right to that phone and talk sweet sweet nothings to their to their wives at home. They be on the phone, yeah, I love you, da 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 da. If you black women only knew after you get off the phone with your prison inmate, if you only knew he was doing the thing with some zesty zest men. Go ahead. Then the zesty person sat on his lap and the two men appeared to kiss. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. The clip was shared Tuesday evening, July 18th, hours after the late King Vaughn sexually was called into question. Oh, so your sexuality was calling. Oh, okay, okay, keep going. After a video surfaced where the can be heard telling a person, a prisoner guard, that he was zesty, zesty. Mm -hmm. body cam footage emerged online of bonds behind bars asking to be placed in protective custody because of his sexual uh, orientation. Mm -hmm. uh, King Little J is now addressing the rumor surrounding his sexual Sexuality did they around. put out did they put out that King Von a footage just to promote King Little J? And is King Little J is trying to recapitalize off of Little Nas X? What people would do for some clout. What people would do for a little bit of fame. You know what I'm saying? I, hey, I say I guess if young thug can get away with having a dress on. On his album cover. I guess these rappers can continue to do these things like this. Go ahead. After a pair of videos surfaced online allegedly featuring the Chicago rapper kissing another inmate sitting on his lap. In a video shared on Instagram, Lil J denies being the man in the viral video and claims effort are being made to cheer, to tarnish his name in light of the recent allegations against King Von. Well, I tell you what, using King Von, a uh, uh, a popular a. Uh, a popular rapper using King Von to promote a rapper named King Little Little J. Because hey, I don't think I heard of him. I don't think a lot of people heard of King Little J. But I bet you after that report then came out, and this report came out, now a lot of people hear about King Little J. So is this a plot to put out that first article about? King Von, just to promote King Little J, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and now King Little J said, "Yo, oh, this is just to tarnish my reputation." You know, what I'm saying? is this just to get you a buzz? Is that what it is? That's what I think. You know what I'm saying? What people will do for clout? It's a shame. It is. That's it, Sister Smith. It is a shame what people will do for clout. You know what I'm saying? It, you know what I'm saying? It, it's nothing that they won't do. Anyway, that's news. You tuned in to Illuminati Radio with your host, Pastor Michael Smith, co host, Sister Smith, baby. Sister Smith, baby. If you're new to this channel, new to this, hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bells. Hit that like button as well. Uh, don't forget to tune into the nightly Bible study class every night at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time right here on ISBC Truth. Don't want to miss out? Hit that subscribe button so you get notifications.
And don't forget, uh, whatever platform you get, you listen to your podcast on, whether it be Spotify, Google, you know what I'm saying? We're streaming 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Spotify, Google, Apple, wherever you get your podcast from, wherever you listen to your podcast from. All you have to do is go to that platform, type Illuminati Radio, and then see my logo, then hit that follow button. Till next time, see you guys tonight at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Bible study class. Uh, how you bless y'all? How you, 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 how you